Hey, um, thanks for coming, everybody. I, I know we're all stretched thin at the moment. We're all here for you, Robbie. We know this is important to you. But we should move things along. I know what you're all thinking. You thought Blaze was a major league asshole. Wow, I thought Professor Xavier was the mind reader, Logan. Quiet, you. Anyway, Blaze. Yeah, he wasn't nice. But it's not a nice world. And sometimes you gotta be that way to get things done. And he really got a lot of things done. So, you kids remember that. You won't always be so fresh-faced and innocent. <sighs> Thanks, Logan. Uh, you said it better than I ever could. To be honest, I, I really struggled with what I was gonna say. Because I used to worship the flaming ground Blaze rode on. And then I met him. And, safe to say, I didn't worship him so much anymore. Fairly certain, I hated him. Right until he went and sacrificed his life to save mine. Johnny might not have been perfect. But at the end of the day, he was one of us. And I'm glad to have known him. To Johnny Blaze. Johnny Blaze. Johnny Blaze. Johnny Blaze. <sighs> Johnny, Johnny, Johnny Blaze. Is that it? Can we go now? Pull up a stool, Hunter. Never too early to get caffeinated. Stark convinced me to put a shot of his new Stark Drive energy drink in my coffee. Stark Drive? Sure. It tastes like sweaty gym sock dipped in coffee, but at least it wakes you up. And if we're headed to Transia, I'm gonna need it. This thing could last 24 hours or 24 days. Hard to tell. This group does not waste time. We will strike at Hydra and Transia quickly, and we will win. Now there's a real rah-rah spirit I can get behind. I've got no time for long stays overseas. I don't like to pack a toothbrush, and my transient is pretty terrible. It makes sense that Lilith would go there. Back to the homeland, that is. Back to the source of her powers. She's gonna be in for a real nasty shock if she's looking for home. It's not like the old days with the Knights of Wundagore riding around the place. Red Skull and Hydra did a pretty good job of screwing Transia up in every way possible. Lilith does not care about the country or its people. If she could gain power from a desert island, she would go there. Too bad she doesn't go to a desert island. Transy is nasty this time of year. It looks like the others are gathering now in the war room. Yep, I'll head that way myself. Just need a few more sips of sweaty gym sock. I gotta talk to Stark about getting some new flavors. You know, you should consider getting yourself a nice cloak. Really? Why? A good cloak adds so much gravitas to your presence. It commands respect and exudes authority. Plus, it's very comfortable. Assuming you choose a good fabric, of course. I'm intrigued. Maybe you can help me pick one out. Absolutely. One day, when we're not running around to put out Hydra's fires, you and I should go shopping. There is an excellent place in the West Village I could take you to. That sounds wonderful. I'm always up for a new look. Once you get one, you'll want to wear it everywhere, trust me. Do you have many cloaks, or just the one? Oh, I had many. Have many. Unfortunately, most are still locked away in the Sanctum, so I have only one now. Oh. It seems to have served you well. Yes. Yes, it has. Let me know if you have other cloak-related questions. I'll be around. To think, long ago the nation of Transia was once the seat of power for the heroic Knights of Wondergore. Might as well be Camp Hydra these days. They're pulling in reinforcements from everywhere. But reinforcing what, exactly? Mount Wondergore. There's been something wrong with that place for as long as I can remember. Something like this. Nothing wrong with that. 
that, now we know where to strike. Time for a little payback on Queen, Demon... No? Right. Make one slight mistake. Handing my mother the last page of the Darkhold? <laughs> Bringing back the Hulk. Okay, same mistake, technically. Fine. You take point, then. Roger that. Actually, how about you let us handle things? The Sanctum, Tony's Gamma Death Star, uh, Wanda... Think about it. Every time we listen to you all, some new catastrophe seems to happen. You're not our babysitter, Hunter. You're our leader. And we are the Midnight Suns. We're family. And family's family. So this time, we got your back. Then what are we waiting for? I like how she just took charge. Tony has said nothing. I mean, to be real, like in the movies too, it's always Tony Stark's fault. Something happens. What if we aim for his heart or something? Uh, he's not a vampire. He's a gamma-powered muscle man. Juiced up with a heavy dose of Lilith's corruption. In other words, we're screwed. Look, I know Lilith is like a dark goddess with an extra angry Hulk as her number two. Don't forget the parchment of power. She's got that too, which is like super OP. But we've got something that she doesn't. A death wish? No, dude. We've got friends. Each other. We're the Midnight Suns. And you know what we Suns do? We rise. We've got this, guys. We have to believe in ourselves if we're gonna pull this off. Blade, Robbie, you know what to do, right? We'll see you soon, Nico. Better not leave me hanging, because our entire continued existence depends on us. Right. No pressure. It's just the end of the world. Not if we can help it. Yeah, we're gonna need more than friendship, though, to take the Hulk now. Just saying. I'll be monitoring the troops' movements from here. You have a small window to strike the facility and get out. What if we like the place and want to move in? Watch it. If you want to prove yourself on this mission, you don't need to start acting like Tony Stark. You're traveling to the heart of Lilith's power. We know. We'll be extra, extra careful. Demon energy barriers or jolly green monsters? Then they're ours. That rude. Lilith, too. So it was here all along. Wanda was right. She usually is. Right. One problem at a time. Midnight Suns, assemble! Or whatever. Yes. Midnight Suns assemble or whatever. Why not? Alright. <clears throat> it looks as if Lilith has sent every last Hydra goon she could find to guard the entrance. Between the creepy glow and the howling demonic hulk, I think we're running out of time. We must not let them stand in our way. yourself blindly for Lilith? You are more foolish than you look. <laughs> that looks funny. Your 
your mistake. I didn't know all these people were looking at her. There is no place to hide. A weak attempt. To think this was once hallowed ground, long before Lilith was entombed here. Too bad it was Hydra that finally stuck around. Kathan has been waiting eons for this moment. I'm not giving Hydra any more credit than I have to. Nor should you. All who serve Lilith will fall. Dang, he went all the way over there. Just as the stories told us, you are strong. Going to pay for that. Wait, what? She had half health. How is that possible? <sighs> Even with his, his vulnerable, I shouldn't have lost half health. Though. I gotta remember just to get rid of that guy immediately because that's ridiculous. Half health. What else do mercenaries take in trade? Catered to every corrupted mind. A spell carried on silent whispers. Now is not the time to romanticize our peril. Weak, even for high. Shadows. The Knights of Wondergore held rituals of their own not far from here. They believed this land was cursed. A well-justified conclusion. Wondergore resonates with the dark energies of Cathan. Even the mountain could not contain his vile influence forever. Our enemy draws near. You're just lucky we aren't allowed to take your life. We'll get rid of him now. I'll give it a whirl. Leave some for the rest of us. Twice, right? Oh, don't need it. All right. How 
invigorating. There we go. Sons, disassemble. Now you're talking. It's not the most elegant solution, but bringing the roof down on them will certainly put a damper on things. Should have hit a few of those columns with the hell ride. I'm going to tell Robbie you said that. <laughs> Oh wait, I think I messed it up. Oh, and it removes all of my other cards. I had a, a strategy, y'all, and I forgot that move removes all my cards. Look, oh, that was, oh, that's bad. Only the innocent are Hopefully I can get rid of her. Cause if not, she's the other one's gonna get revived. I forgot, dude. All right, good. At least I can get rid of these two. Come get it. All right, it wasn't all for nothing. I was not thinking when it came to that. Haven't cut him loose yet. Do not waste your strength here, child. What has been set in motion cannot be undone. Will not be undone. You have the power to stop this mother. A debt of blood is owed, and a debt of blood shall be paid. The dawn will rise. There's no convincing her. You know what you have to do. It is time. My power knows no limits. Accept your fate.
You are lucky to still be breathing. Get rid of some of these guys. I got a plan. Hold up. That's one. Got a backup blade, and he can just destroy. Use this here. I'll take that. This is gonna hurt. Dang, that helps so much. I didn't Man, that was a lot of damage. Okay, we gotta get this out quickly. Stand them multipliers. One more hit like that, I don't think we'll survive. Sarah, my sister. It's been far too long. Don't speak as if you know me, demon. You haven't been my sister for centuries. It saddens me to hear you say that. But there's still time for you to see things his way. No one calling themselves the Midnight Sun will ever join your corrupted ranks. I promise you that. What? I need to lower some of these enemies. I hate how that damages Ghost Rider. Wait, why are they not dead? Oh, that's right. They explode. Nice. I forgot about that. Oh, we took out three at once. I forgot all about that. I am impressed. Still got three. Nice. Then if that's the case, let's get Blade now. We can put the block on us after that with the counter Did you miss me oh wait oh crap I didn't even know I thought that was for all the teammates I have no more cards oh come on game like give me better cards dude like I have a lot of cards I don't need a lot of, I don't need a uh, heroes and for and they keep giving me the ones with the most heroism. I need to definitely change that. I thought I changed it already. Look at that. It's supposed to counter immediately. Why the heck is it doing that move first? That's not even fair. So he gets to do that in multiplier before I do my counter. Wait, I have a counter! Where's my counter at? Where? Did I read the card wrong? Did it not say counter? I know I have block. I thought it said counter, or am I reading too fast? Some. I, did that thing not say counter? Oh my goodness, dude. I'm just. I'm messed up today. It's late at night. Maybe I'm just looking at. seeing stuff the wrong way. I don't know, but I thought it said counter. Withstanding the dark energies of that book long enough to fully restore it. Nothing but trouble since this whole thing started. We both know what it is like to have a power that others desire, Blade. Maybe, but I don't rip my clothes off and go berserk whenever I'm in a bad mood. I saw a move like that once, centuries ago.
I don't even see that one next to me. It's a glitch, okay. You have earned this. So it's just one. Okay, we'll just get rid of him. You were too weak for this fight. As commanded, no escape. Should have just nuked this place from orbit. You know he's got one somewhere. With the Hulk as it is, I doubt that would calm his temper. I say we do it anyway. Burn them all. Your mother abandons you. Years. Wait, I thought she said, wait, when I destroyed the other pillar, I thought she said one more pillar would be enough. I guess not. Why well, I gotta make this count? These are a lot of enemies. Hold up. Glitch in the game. All right. You do not have to show off for me, Blade. Wait, what? Did I not see him have full health, or was he next to another enemy that had the full bar? Oh my goodness, I had a strategy with Blade too, man. And these cards are useless, right? Because that, wasn't that the second time down? Feel my call. I need health. Hopefully my character lives. Oh no. Where did that come from? What the heck? Double? They cannot I was say the game cheated me and let them die. How did it get double uh corruption? I didn't even know my character got corrupted. Oh no. And we get corrupted after we attack. I need some health. Like where's my health? I usually get it every time. Now all of a sudden, they keep giving me these cards that are too... There we go. Wait, hold on. Still no health. I need to remove all negative effects. I have nothing to attack. Dude, this game keeps giving me all these heroism cards. Well, look at this. I got three. I do not have this in my pack, y'all. I don't have three of these cards. So why is this giving me three cards?
Like, how is that fair, though? It's giving me cars that I don't even have. I don't have three of them. Welcome, assistance. And look at this. Are you serious? There's literally nothing I can do, bro. I have three card plays, but I can't even use it because it's giving me trash cards. What? How is that even fair, though? Like, it's giving me cards I don't have. I don't have three of those cards. The game just cheated me right there. Like, what the heck? Like, how you gonna give me three of something I don't have? Man, give me my basic cars. I have so many basic cars, bro. That just wasn't fair, though. Like, that was cheating. Can't give me three of the base the same cars that are not even ones I can use. And I had three car plays. The game did not want me to win it. Don't discard. Oh, I keep forgetting about the discard, man. Man, why does it do much better damage than that? Like, what the heck? Give me better damage, Ghost Rider. Like, it's a, a dog and you can't take him out in one hit? I hate how that move damages him. I don't know why it damages him when he's not even getting hit. Like that once, centuries ago. She will sustain us. You are too weak for this fight. Thank God they won't multiply, and I'll able to get rid of the connection enemy, so they won't revive each other. They did not want me to win that one. Like, you gave me the same cars. Looks like they still want a piece. Do not waste your strength. Yeah, I was right. What has been set in motion? Yeah, it was a glitch. Like I, I thought I was tripping for a second, but this card gives you a counter. And it didn't even it didn't use any of that. Okay, I wasn't tripping. Yeah, they, they, they didn't want me to win that one. Because I thought I was tripping. I'm like, wait a minute. How in the world I don't, uh, not countering? And the game wanted me to lose. Makes perfect sense now. Are you serious, game? I can't believe I'm wasting full. Like, why is my attack so low? I upgraded these characters and it took all that to get rid of the dog? Oh, crap. Please don't hit the floor. Dang it, I just saw it at the last second. And it it uh, took away Blaze Shield. I have not shaken their confidence. Sarah, my sister. It's been far too long. Don't speak as if you know me, demon. You haven't been my sister for centuries. 
saddens me to hear you say that. But there's still time for you to see things his way. No one calling themselves a Midnight Sun will ever join your corrupted ranks. I promise you that. I need some attacks. Like, what are these cars, man? Look at this. They keep giving me these same... Like, they, it's like they don't want me to finish these enemies off, bro. I have a lot of basic not using heroism cars, and it's not letting me do that. Like, I got two car plays. And then my guy's attacks don't even finish them off. As I said it before, these minions are more tougher than boss battles, bro. the same card all the cards I got they keep giving me the same one that's why I think they just don't want me to succeed like what the heck is going on with the same pool and I still didn't even take down a pillar yet oh come on the one man or monster capable of withstanding the dark energies of that book long enough to fully restore it. Banner's been nothing but trouble since this whole thing started. We both know what it is like to have a power that others desire. He's gonna explode. I was trying to get him away from us so he doesn't explode on us. They cannot possibly match your strength. I wanted to see that animation with the team attack, but it's gotta play it smart. Oh wait! Dang it! Oh wait! Why is that? Do that doll should be dead. Unless it's another glitch. I'm curious. Okay, it's another glitch. All right, I'm about to say. I need to sacrifice some life because I need to get his life down. I accident. I'm like, wait, I hit the wrong. I'm moving too fast. I meant to get rid of this card, not the other one. Dang. not mean to do that because he had five chain and I could have changed it five times but I accidentally hit the wrong one at least he's bleeding if you still want it come and get it Stark should have just nuked this place from orbit you know he's got one somewhere we have enough problems with the Hulk as it is I doubt that would calm his temper I say we do it anyway 
You're going to discard a card. Let me make sure. Use this first. You have earned this. If I used the other card, it would have something would have got discarded. I don't lose any cards I have yet. Let me hold that for next turn because if I use this, more reinforcements are gonna come, which means more enemies to have to fight. Unless. Nah, yeah, let's play, let's play it smart. I'm gonna risk it. I'm ready to get these pillars out of here. How many was that? Two? Additional Hydra forces en route. Get ready. Oh, are you kidding me? And I have no. No, I wanted to. I can't even move them so I can switch it around. Alright, who has the lowest health? My character, so. Oh, the look how the game just cheats me. They just love put messing me up, bro. Gotta keep my character alive. But literally, see how they keep them all in a straight line? Oh, it wasn't me. Okay, I thought it was me that got KO'd. It was one of his. In all right, all right. Dogs get like, oh my gosh! I can't believe dogs doing as much damage, but it takes me forever to kill them. They have not changed their plans. Like, look, one hit. I can't finish them off. Why do these enemies have so much health? Like, that makes no sense. I need this, yeah, to damage him. And I get life steal, so I get some health. Oh my goodness, are you serious? There we go, at least I get concealed because these three got it. Okay. Oh goodness gracious, they give these dogs so much health. Once again, Lilith's servants fall. That's the turn, okay. Goodness, dude. Like, who would have thought dogs would be so much, so much, uh, issue? So much of an issue? This is way worse than just fighting the hawk. Nope, that's not what I want. This better finish him off. Okay. Return to your mother. You are I'm trying to get rid of him so I can get this other pillar down. I need one more pillar. And applies to bleed. Nice.
Oh, I can end it right now. Okay. Leave some for the rest of us. There we go. I can't believe they cheated me that last round with all them same repeated cards. And that counter. Oh, I'm so glad I read that again because I thought I was tripping. I know it was late at night. You would have thought that was a boss battle. Which has I been hope Aunt May isn't watching this because she's going to flip. Has suddenly appeared in the war-torn Republic. Try to stop it, but decimating a we screwed up, Robbie. It's okay. You can say it. Doesn't matter who screwed up. What matters is that we're screwed. Every social media outlet with the hashtag Apocalypse Wow. We're in the end game now. Will I see you at the meeting? Yeah, maybe. Depends how bored I am. Heading to book club. Are you? Meet you there. Kind of like the wrong time for over. this, but okay. I want my upgrades. My plan backfired. Thought choosing a weird book would drive people away. Why would you do that? More punch for the rest of us. Why have I not heard of Crash Morgan? I know it's an older book, but this is exactly the kind of story I like. I thought Logan might bail. But I told him we bring more snacks this time. I have him figured out. Let's get this started. I am ready. All right, Logan, I need to know. Why did you choose this book? I'll tell you, just not yet. I want to hear what you thought of this book. It was written in the 1940s, so I expected some repugnant attitudes and phrases. 
but it surprised me. The writing was simple, yet the story was deeper than it had any right to be. What was your favorite part? It's in the chapter where Crash and the Princess escape the Zorgots. The next morning, they see the sunrise and Mars rising beside it. When the Princess asks what the future holds and Crash just stares at Mars as it eclipses the sun, it gave me chills. Is it just me, or do the stellar bodies represent their time together? Absolutely. The time they have together is fleeting. I think this is where Crash first realizes there's no future for the two of them. Anyway, I think the moment gets lost when the Zorgots deploy their Null Stalkers. I don't get why the robot dog didn't warn them. I thought it could talk. Not until number 19, the minefields of the Reticulates. It's a whole thing. Got it. So, what's the idea with Crash's promise? What about it? When Crash apprehends Glaxogorp, they have a tense conversation in the back of the flypod. Crash says there's a way the Zorgots can leave the moon with everything they want, but the princess must take the throne. Then Crash vows that no queen of royal blood shall ever rule Deimos. Glaxogorp agrees, but why? Crash breaks the vow in the next chapter. That makes no sense. Why say Queen of Royal Blood? You're right. I can't believe I missed that. And how does that tie into the Hydro gunfight at the top of the space scraper? Really? You don't see it? <laughs> I do. They're shapeshifters. Who? Crash and Glaxogorp. No. Yep. But then, when do they... The Hydro gun fight. Crash gets hit in the helmet and goes down. And what happens whenever Crash is unconscious? The helmet changes color. Turns bronze like the suit. Right. Then Glaxogorp pulls up on the rocket sled and takes Crash and the princess into custody. That's when they make the switch. Crash and Glaxogorp change form. But where do they stash the princess? It is obvious. They put her in Crash's suit. Exactly. Crash won't need it to survive because they're within the Bubble City. So we get to the Dimos Council meeting. The princess refuses the throne and declares her love for Crash, who is the princess in Crash's suit. When they embrace, the false princess deactivates the Magna Manacles binding Crash. But Crash nabs the Star Scepter from the fake princess, activates the suit's zoom vest, and smashes through the monoculus. So, if that's the actual princess, she escapes. But who is the false princess? That's a shape-shifted Glaxogorp. Without the Star Scepter, Deimos can't crown their queen. Right. She never wanted it, and the Zorgots definitely don't want it. Glaxogorp, posing as the princess, can steer Deimos away from war. And when the fake Glaxogorp vows the Star Scepter shall be restored to the princess, that's actually Crash. So Crash made two vows and broke neither of them. The cliffhanger with Glaxogorp chasing Crash's ship is actually Crash returning to the princess so they can escape Deimos. You got it. They reveal the switcheroo at the beginning of number six, Attack of the Intergalactic Space Weasels. Clever. I like it more now. And that's where we'll call it for tonight. So, Logan, why did you pick this book? Because it's fun. I almost wish this book was a comic instead. I would have liked to see the monoculus. My book was the best of them. You have only been to two meetings. Yeah, but you know I'm right. You did not mention a book for next time. Yeah, with everything going on, I'm gonna put Book Club on a hiatus. There we until go. things are less apocalyptic. I hope we come back to this in the future. Same here. It's gonna be fun Books doing a Book Club with like Deadpool. For Not to call anyone out, but you just can't feed your mind gristle. Who else would you invite if you could? Hmm. 
There's a lawyer who got me out of a bad situation a few years back. Smart as a whip, picks up on subtle things even I tend to miss. What, Matt Murdock? As long as the books we read have Braille copies, I uh, could convince Yeah, Daredevil. Is he going to be a DLC Actually, character? That would be cool. I need to thank you for sticking around since the beginning. He's one of my top five Marvel characters. Daredevil. Of course. I don't get close to many people. I never get into relationships. That's not a rule I ever break. But I did with Carol. Beyond all the reasons, I find her amazing. Do you know why? You are into her because she can kick your ass. That's exactly it. <laughs> really? I was joking. I'm not. Vampires fight dirty. They'll kill whoever you love just because they can. If they really want you to suffer, they'll turn your true love into one of them. That's why dating me is a death sentence, and I refuse to put that weight on anyone. But can you imagine some pissant vampire trying to chow down on Captain Marvel? First, his fangs would snap off on contact with her skin. Then she'd just chuck it into space. No hiding from the sun out there. There's no way they can ever touch her. But it's not a good, just that. a really good point. It is you. She is safe from you. Yeah. I never break my rule because I know deep down there's a chance I could lose control. But with Carol, hell, she could hold me over her head till I was myself again. Wouldn't even break a sweat. Completely unrelated, I want to watch Captain Marvel bench press Blade. I would not. You are no fun. And you already knew that. Well, I'm glad you joined me for all of this. Maybe next time the world is ending, I'll start a sparring club. A sparring club? Is that just training with a fancy name? You saw right through me. You headed out? I am taking off. Good meeting. Blade and Captain Marvel. Interesting. <clears throat> Let me guess. You came to rub it in? Tell me the Midnight Suns are just a bunch of Hero Academy dropouts who are in over their heads? I'm not here to rub anything in. I came here to say... I thought what you did back there was brave and bold. <laughs> yeah, right. You mean brave and stupid? You weren't being stupid. You did what you thought was right. Sometimes we can do everything in our power to stop a bad thing from happening and still fall flat on our faces. Just keep your chin up and remember, failure is an essential part of the superhero gig. I mean, look at me. I haven't exactly been batting a thousand these days, but that doesn't seem to have slowed down my ego any. Uh, well, wait. Are you, like, actually being nice to me? Well, nothing like impending doom to bring people together. But seriously, I admire what you tried to pull off back there. It took a lot of guts. Maybe next time, you'll get the glory. Thanks, Tony. Yay, we did it. Ugh, the first time we're actually trusted to sit in the driver's seat, the first freaking time, and we couldn't stop her. We dropped a mountain on her head, and Lola still managed to summon the Temple of Cathod. Way to go, team. Like Tony said, you gave it your best shot. What you and Robbie did took real courage, and that is a victory all unto itself. Well, I'd rather have a real win for once. You will get there. Ugh, how come you always manage to say the exact right thing to make me feel better? It is one of my secret superpowers. You mean not-so-secret superpower? All right, I'm gonna stay out here a while and lick my wounds for a little bit longer. Thanks for, uh, checking up on me. Anytime. Ah, Hunter, good to see you. Wanda, there's something I ought to say to you. Oh? You were 
right about Lilith's tomb. Did you just say I was right about something? I did. Just as you were probably right about other things, too. Many other things. You let an old, stubborn immortal let you take the blame for so much. You were hurting. You needed something to point to. And here I was thinking I was the one who was supposed to take care of all of you. I am sorry, Wanda. For everything. So am I. I see you and Caretaker are on the mend. Seems so. I should be happy about it. But how can I be happy about anything when the Temple of Cthulhu is wreaking havoc on my home? I grew up in Transia, you know. In a remote village at the foot of Mount Wondercore. It's all destroyed now. Along with those poor people's lives. If Transians are anything like you, I have faith in their resiliency. We are known for being a tough crowd. It's a hard life there. Lots of conflict. Lots of tragedy. Hard lives make hard people. They will survive. And one day, rebuild. And I'd like to be around to help them. But first, we have to stop your mom. I'm afraid of her, you know. Of seeing her. I mean, what if it happens again? What if she turns me back into bad Wanda? What if I... go dark? If it... came to that, we would find a way of removing her corruption again. I appreciate that. But I don't think you're going to have time for all that while you're also trying to stop Cthon from tentacle climbing into this dimension. You are right. We probably will not have time to save you. You wouldn't? I am joking. <sighs> you almost got me there. No one is leaving you behind ever again. Promise? Cross my heart. Ah, <sighs> well. I ought to get back to the news, see what new horrors are befalling my hometown. Do not watch too much of it. The overconsumption of news media is supposed to be bad for your mental health, especially during an apocalypse. I agree with that. That's why I don't watch the news now. There are worse things. They love sharing bad too. news. And I'm pretty sure I've experienced them all. I'll take my chances with a little cable news. You have gone too far, Mother. I could say the same to you, child. Leaving me for dead and buried under that mountain. What a way to treat your mother. What would you have me do? Allow you to destroy all of creation? The Hulk was right. You are somewhat overdramatic. The truth shall reveal itself soon enough. The Darkhold is finally complete. The prophecy draws to its close. The Midnight Sun is coming, and with it, him. We will all have our final parts to play. Will you be ready when the curtain rises? If everything you do is truly for me, Mother, then I beg you to stop. Let us both return to our graves and let the world know peace. You almost sound like him. I thought we could not talk about him here. Don't be ridiculous, not him. Him, your father. He once said something similar to me several lifetimes ago. I have never heard you speak of him until now. We close upon the end of a billion years prophecy. Forgive me if I'm a bit... sentimental. I sometimes wonder if I could bring his soul to this place. To have him stand once more beside me. Beside us. I implore you, do not. 
In his death, he has been spared the sight of the foul creature you have become. I envy him for that. What? No snappy comeback? Promises that we shall be reunited under the glorious eye of the Midnight Sun? No, child. Not this time. Hmm. Struck a nerve.